I'm getting so sick of these Zoom calls, these Zoom <laughs> classes. You ever pretend to have your face frozen to get out of a Zoom meeting? <laughs> 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 it works. We just had Mother's Day. Do you have any parents? In the Woo! Where are our parents? The rest of you, tell me, what do you do for aggravation? <laughs> I went to see my mom on Mother's Day. She's doing great. She takes every supplement that exists. She's taking something called Prevagen. It's supposed to improve your memory. It's a ridiculous product. It comes from uh, jellyfish. Oh. Now, when were jellyfish ever known for their memory? I've never seen a jellyfish in Jeopardy. <laughs> now, if a cake was made from elephants, that would make sense, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. 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 <clears throat> but then you worry about side effects like weight gain. <laughs> My mother's a very loving person, but she has kind of a harsh exterior. She doesn't like that I'm doing stand-up. She's uh. saying things like, what do you want to get up in front of strangers and humiliate yourself? <laughs> That's my job. <laughs> <laughs> She's critical. She goes, stop being such a people pleaser. Uh. So I stopped, which pleased her. <laughs> <laughs> my mother was a stay-at-home mom. Woo. And I was very lucky to have her love and attention you know, she never worked outside the home. Uh, you might say, well, she gave me a lot of quantity time. Uh, <laughs> I had her undivided attention. <laughs> Ooh, yes. yes. <laughs> She'd say things like, Ellen, life is not a popularity contest. Right. And I think, lucky for you, because you would lose. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes she gets a little blue, like we all do. She, the other time I, I saw her on Mother's Day, she said, Ellen, when I die, I don't want everyone dressed in black. I don't want to look down and see a bunch of crows. I said, first of all, Mom, I didn't say this, but I thought, <laughs> what do you mean a bunch? <laughs> if you're lucky, it's going to be me and the doorman. Oh. And what makes you think you'll be looking down? Oh. 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 I know, I know, we're getting, we're letting it out. <laughs> letting it all out. I used to work as a psychiatrist. Woo. How do you wow. feel about that? <laughs> <laughs> Anybody here in therapy? Yeah. Yeah, I am. I love it. It's it's helped me a lot. Anyone in therapy, but ashamed to admit it. <laughs> Anyone hearing so many voices, you don't know what I just said. <laughs> Doing therapy in Manhattan is like selling band-aids at the Battle of Gettysburg. <laughs> it's very stressful. Every day you go in and face incredible fear, sadness, rage. That's just the staff. <laughs> Yeah, and the holidays, the holidays are the worst. I always got stuck working in the psychiatric emergency room on Christmas Eve, and then one shift alone, I saw 12 hypochondriacs, 11 obsessive compulsives, <laughs> 10 pyromaniacs, yeah. 9 alcoholics, 8 anorexics, 5 crack oh. <laughs> <laughs> Let it out, let it out. In Europe, they honor this man. There's even a Freud Airlines. The plane has two sections, guilt and shame. And the seats go all the way back to childhood. And the planes are shaped like a penis, and the other planes envy it. I think our time is up. Thank you very much.